To defend their borders, India must ensure that its arsenal is ready to hit the enemy hard if that time comes. And in this episode, I'm looking at 10 most powerful missiles that India's military has in their possession. What's going on, guys? This is Leroy Kenton here, and welcome back to FTD Facts. And this is a follow up episode on the video that I did about the 10 most powerful air defense systems that India has. So if you have not seen that video, I'll have a link to it down below in the video description section. Definitely check it out. Okay, so enough chit chat let's jump into this episode starting at number 10 we have the Astra this is an all-weather beyond visual range air-to-air -air missile and it is capable of receiving course corrections mid-flight the maximum range of the Astra is 110 kilometers and the Astra can lock onto targets before or after its launch so it's pretty impressive missile but moving on to number nine we have the Agni 1 missile Agni means fire and it also refers to the Vedic fire god in Hinduism so of course this one's a pretty powerful missile it is a short-range ballistic missile and the missile is capable of carrying a nuclear payload it can travel at a speed of 9,000 kilometers an hour the Akash surface-to-air missile comes in at number eight now this is a supersonic medium-range mobile surface-to-air missile and it has has indigenous radio frequency. Now this was developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization or the DRDO for short and the missile system it can target an aircraft up to 30 kilometers away. All right so here we have the Prithvi 2. So this is a nuclear capable surface to surface short range ballistic missile and it was first test fired back on January 27th 1996 and the development stages were completed in the year 2004. And this variant was also inducted into the Indian Army as well. Now, in a test, the missile was launched with an extended range of 350 kilometers, which is about 220 miles, and it had an improved navigation due to an inertial navigation system. Next up is the Prithvi supersonic interceptor missile. So, this missile is capable of destroying any type of ballistic missile coming towards it at low altitudes. So, this Prithvi interceptor is a 7.5 meter long single stage solid rocket propelled guided missile and it's equipped with a navigation system it has a high-tech computer and an electromechanical aviator and it can destroy incoming hostile ballistic missiles less than 30 kilometers in altitude halfway in we have the Agni 2 so this is the second Agni missile on this list the Agni 2 is a medium-range ballistic missile and the Agni 2 was first tested on April 11th of 1999 the missile was tested to 2000 2,300 kilometers in 1999 and again in 2001 it was 2,100 kilometers but that had a different payload however this missile is said to be able to hit targets up to 3,000 kilometers away despite what the tests showed another Agni missile this time we have the Agni 5 the Agni 5 is a long-range surface-to-surface ballistic missile test fired successfully from the Dr. Abdul Kalam Island in Odisha. And this missile is pretty impressive. It has a strike range of 5,000 kilometers and it is a nuclear capable intercontinental ballistic missile. The Agni 5 was mainly created to amplify India's nuclear deterrence against China and the missile can cover most of China in its range. The Danush ballistic missile is at the number three spot, and this is a ballistic missile that was test fired successfully in 2018. This nuclear capable ballistic missile has a strike range of 350 kilometers from a naval ship, and the Danush missile is capable of carrying a payload of 500 kilograms and hitting both land and sea based targets. Bravos is next. This missile is from India and Russia and it's the fastest cruise missile in the entire world. It can reach speeds of Mach 2.8 to Mach 3.0. Now there's a hypersonic version called a Bravos 2 which can reach speeds of Mach 7 to Mach 8. The great thing about this missile is that it can easily be launched from an aircraft, submarine, can be launched from ships as well as land and it can fly at a distance of just 10 meters above the ground. Now the number one missile on this list is the Surya missile. Surya means sun in Sanskrit and the Surya missile is an intercontinental ballistic missile that's speculated to be in development by India. The missile has warhead capabilities. The Surya missile has a surface based, underwater base and submarine based variants and has a range of over 10,000 kilometers. Now the only thing is that none of this is 100% confirmed but if the capabilities are as accurate 
accurate as speculated, this is one monstrous missile. So that was your look at 10 of the most powerful Indian missiles. So pretty impressive arsenal they got there. As always, leave your thoughts and comments down below about anything else that I shared. I love to read your comments and I'm going to be replying to them. You got to check out another related video. So you can do that by tapping the annotation right here. You'll definitely love it. Trust me. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so you don't miss any of our daily episodes here on FTD Facts. Okay guys, it's been awesome. So until next time, stay awesome, stay educated. We'll see you tomorrow.